how about we play some old school double top dollar? This is old school double top dollar here at the Windover Nugget in West Windover, Nevada. <clears throat> Excuse me, this is a $1 denomination machine. So max two coin, so two credits to play. Uh, we got a hundred bucks in here. We're gonna see if we can't turn that hundred into maybe two hundred, or uh, maybe we'll get really, really lucky and we'll get that top uh, thousand credit offer to light up. So, hundred bucks in this machine, uh, two credit bet, so two bucks to spin. Looking for that top dollar to fall right there on the third reel. All right, hey, cherries are good. Ooh, give me that top dollar down one. Come on. Ah, oh, needed up one now. Went down too far. All right, come on, top dollar. Double top dollar. Oh man, needed that other single bar. Come on, oh man, would have taken either one of those. Think of my goal on this one, if we get up to 200, we'll cash it out. So hey, that's only really good offer. One really good offer. We just need that top dollar to come out. Let me know in the comments what your favorite version of top dollar is. If you prefer double top dollar or regular top dollar or the new top dollar, top dollar grand that just came out. Just need that top dollar to pop out, come on. Another double? Oh, would have taken that too. Oh, come on, top dollar. Drop down. One. I still love these classic games. I would prefer the older top dollars to the newer top dollars. I really would. Still something about them. Of course, it would be better if the top dollar actually landed on the line for us. Okay, there's a cherry. Cherry gets a sorbet back. Come on, top dollar. Just about halfway through our uh, original hundred that we put in here. Still looking for that top dollar. Let's see. The handle work, handle works, okay. Hey, we got a cherry. At least it's our bat back. Oh man, even those doubles down. Let's go top dollar, come on. Take the cherry. No top dollar yet. I think that's the first combination of bars we've gotten so far in this video. Five dollars is what that paid. Oh man, needed that double up. Take cherry. Still looking for that top dollar. It's hiding from us today. I mean, it's showing itself, but not on the line. That's another myth buster for you guys. A lot of people say if it starts to show itself that it, it's due or something crazy like that, it's not due. So don't fall for that. If it's showing itself on the line or above or below, it means absolutely nothing. it is okay it's gotta be a really good offer hopefully we need at least 80 credits first offer to be even 25 credits 25 credits that's definitely a no-go but if you ever are wondering if it's a good offer or not you can always look down here on these older machines and it'll say it right there so best place let's try again so we are going to try again we're going to hit that try again button 
Second offer. Thousand times two times two. Fifteen. Ah, uh, that's lower than the last one. Still trying again. Fifteen credits. Oh man. Ah, uh, going all the way to the end. Come on. Thirty credits. Okay, I think that's our highest one. Thirty bucks. We'll take it. $30 on that top dollar hit brings us up to $57 in the machine. Not the best offer in the world, but hey, you know what? It's ammo to keep on going. Oh, man. Double. Hopefully we can get that top dollar to come out one more time. Oh man, on the line one more time. Top dollar. Ah. Oh. Jeez, oh. That's one combination I have yet to hit is double, red seven, double. Two doubles and a red seven. Haven't hit it on top dollar, haven't hit it on pinball, haven't hit it on anything. Would love to get that combination. There we go, okay, hey, we'll take that, 10 bucks. Take that, another 10 bucks, hey. Up to about $49, not bad. Slowly creeping back up. Trying to get there slowly. Um, those two up would have been really nice. Let's see what would that been? Be 40 credits times four. Come on, top dollar. At least give us one more top dollar here. Oh, up a little bit. Machine doesn't listen to me very well, does it? Except up a little bit. Double. I would have taken just regular triple bar. Oh, come on, do dollar. Okay, hey, we'll take a cherry. It's our bet back. Something. Anytime you can get at least your bet back, it's, it's good. Obviously, winning is better, but hey, you know what? Sometimes... Sometimes a push is a win. Gets you one more spin. All right, we need some last minute save here. Come on, top dollar. Got 13 bucks left. Hey, there it is. All right, hey. We got 13 bucks left. Let's try to make this one at least 100. Come on. First offer. A thousand times two times two. Ten credits. Well, we already know that that's a reject. Eight. Try that Second again. Offer. Twenty credits. Still bad. Third offer. Thirty credits. All right, thirty credits is about what we got last time. Machine says try again. Let's go for it. Final offer. There we go. Hey, we got some multipliers. Times two. All right. 40 credits. Times two. Hey, we got our 80 bucks. 80 credits. Boy, there we go. That was the best offer. Always remember that the machine always gives you the mathematical best answer. So it doesn't always give you the right answer, but it gives you what is mathematically best. So that brings us back up to almost our 100 that we started with. Uh, let's see, what do I want to do here? Hmm. 
I want to say if we can get back up to at least our hundred, we'll cash it out. Uh, but if not, let's set our low stopping point at 50. And this is something that all slot players really need to do is make sure you're setting that upper and lower limit, especially after big wins like that. So even on dollar level, and hey, we're having a lot of fun here at the Windover Nugget today. So uh, $100 or higher or $50 will be our stopping point. Maybe we'll get another top dollar, get really lucky, put us back over that 100 mark. All right, come on, top dollar, come out. Take that double, triple, triple bar. Oh man, top dollar, come on. Let's give you an old school handle pull here. Any luck? Oh man, went too low. A triple bar should be a double. That was a pretty good offer, 80 credits for that top dollar. I was starting to get a little nervous there when it started doing those low numbers, but then those multipliers lit up. Hey, there we go. 10 bucks. Bring us up to 75. Oh, we just need top dollar. Come on. A little lower. Just a little bit. Too low. Went all the way back around. Oh, man. I'd love to get all three of those doubles. Jerry's good. Bet back. Like I said, pushes a win, right? All right. We're down to $57, so we only have a couple more spins left. So hopefully we can get a top dollar. Top dollar. Or double double something. Oh man, all right, this is gonna be our last spin. We're gonna stick with our stopping point of $50. You know what, hey, we're low rolling, we're having fun. They got all kinds of these classic games here at the Windover Nugget in West Windover, Nevada. We've had a lot of fun today, uh, but we're still sticking with our stopping point, 50 bucks. So this is our last spin. Oh man, if that double were up higher, but you know what? We're gonna find that bright green flashing cash out button. We're gonna cash out. We're gonna collect our ticket for $51. Hey, we had a lot of fun. Got to play this old school classic double top dollar. Started with a hundred bucks, took it down to 51. That's what we're leaving with. Got a couple top dollar bonuses. One really good one, one not so good one, but hey, you know what? That's how it goes when you gamble. Anyway, guys, always remember set your stopping points and we'll catch you next episode. Take Thanks care. Thanks so much for watching. Check out these other videos and be sure to subscribe to the channel for more slot tips. It's always free. Visit ropethejackpot.com for free guides and a whole lot more. Catch you on the next episode.